So this is this is a bit of a special video. This is this is a video about Allie and I. This is a little bit of a love story. Allie and I first met over seven years ago. I was a senior in college on the IU swim team and Allie was a coach. Allie was coaching for the IU swim team that year. Allie and I started dating about a year after we first met. March of 2014, we went on our first date and um, I've got a photo here of, this is a photo of us on our very first night out together and when I, when I see that photo, it makes me smile. About six months into our relationship, Allie and I moved into an apartment together. We started living together. Um, here's, here's a photo right here. That's the very first apartment that we, that we ever lived in. 2015 was a really big year for us. We got a dog early on. We got our very first dog, Puff. I love looking at old photos like this. This is the very first day we got her. Allie was so excited, as you can see. And then about five, six months after we got Puff, I found Lego. And when I saw him, when I saw how small he was, he was so, he was the tiniest little dog I'd ever seen. I was like, I have to get him. Puff and Lego, as I'm sure you've seen in some of my videos before, really made us a family. They really brought Allie and I together and really kind of tested our, our parenting skills. And then shortly after I got Lego, I decided to make the leap to take the biggest step in my life ever. I, I, I finally did it. <laughs> he was acting really weird when we were walking on the pier and I was like, why are you being weird? And he was like, no, I'm not being weird, Allie. I'm not being weird. Let's go to the, let's go on the beach. I proposed to Allie in November of 2015. We were in Los Angeles for the, the yearly USA Swimming Golden Goggles. I was so nervous. I was more nervous for that than I'd ever been for, for anything else before. Like my heart, like I felt like I was, I felt like I was about to go into a huge race. Like I was gonna go into battle. Like my heart was beating out of my chest. I got down on one knee. Our feet were in the water. We were on the beach. We were on Manhattan Beach in Los Angeles. And um, it was kind of dark out. Out, but the pier was all lit up with uh, Christmas lights and stuff. Some big things happened in 2016. This house, we bought this house, started living in our very first home. More shocking than anything else, something completely out of the blue. We had a bit of a surprise. This was like less than two months before Olympic trials and then boom, all of a sudden we had puppies. We had to bottle feed this little tiny little baby puppy and you know, that was, that was a special thing. So there we are, a family of four with two new additions, me, Allie, Puff and Leo and these two new little puppy babies that we gave to friends and family and they have really great homes now. This leads us to the fifth year in Allie and I's relationship. I'd like to take a moment mm -hmm. that was not planned for you to just take a deep breath. I still want to marry him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't why. <laughs> it is my honor and delight to declare you husband and wife. Cody, you make this your bride. <laughs> When I think about our wedding, we had we had a real fairy tale beautiful wedding. And the last few years since then have been have been pretty great. Allie and I 
have been living just a pretty nice married life here in this house. Um, we've been fortunate enough to get to travel, to get to go to a lot of really cool places, have a lot of really cool experiences, you know, spend time with friends, um, and really just kind of grow with, with each other. Now, all of this has been building up to right now. That leaves us to right now. I, um, I have an announcement to make to everybody. This, this is our baby. Allie and I are having a baby and we could not be more thrilled about it. Allie and I both decided that January of this year, January of 2020 was when we were gonna start trying to have a family, to have kids. And we found out pretty much right before quarantine, right before lockdown, late February that she she was pregnant. It, it happened really fast. We don't know the gender yet. We are waiting to have a little gender reveal party with some of our friends and family. It has been strange because, you know, with what happened with COVID-19 and the whole lockdown situation, uh, it was kind of a scary time. I mean, it is kind of a scary time to be pregnant, but we're just doing everything that we can to keep ourselves healthy, keep Allie healthy, keep the baby healthy, and just, just kind of do our best and stay positive. I'm making the pregnancy announcement video right now. Do you want to be in it? Maybe. 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 What if you just say, I haven't been in the vlog lately because I've been pregnant and I don't want to show people that I'm pregnant. Um, let me just think about it. <laughs> I'll check my schedule. Okay. You check your schedule and you let me know. Uh, and then I gotta check with the baby schedule. Okay. The two of us over here <laughs> make up the majority of your household. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure the furries would agree with me. So then it would be four on one. Yeah, you're, you're right. You're greatly outnumbered. You're right. No matter what the gender is. You're I right. can't wait to see what the furries do with the baby. I think Lego will try and snuggle with the, the blankets and stuff. All right, I love you. I love you. See you after work. Bye-bye.